Hello children, I am your maths teacher and today we are going to start new chapter that is chapter 5 decimal fractions okay. So first we are going to learn in decimal fraction the first topic is addition and subtraction. So as an example they have given that Nandu went to shop and he buys and there the pen price is four and a half rupees. Razor one and a half rupees, notebook six and a half rupees, and paint box twenty five and a half rupees. Okay, so Nandu is going to buy all these things one pen each one. Okay, one pen, one razor, one notebook, and one paint box. Okay, so let us first see what is the total amount. How will you add? See, one and uh, first one pen price four and a half rupees can be written as 4.50 that is 4 rupees and 50 paise that is 4.50 that is 50 so how much decimal place is there in this decimal two decimal places 0 0.50 for all half rupees everything is having half rupees four and a half one and a half six and a half two and five and a half so all of them are having 0 0.50 in that so first let us see what is the total bill Okay, so total bill. How much will be the total bill? How will you do? Here you are going to do addition of decimals. Okay, so first how will you add? It is same as addition of numbers. Just you have to carry. I will show you. These zeros you will add. It is 0. 5 plus 5. 10 plus 5 is 15. 15 plus 5 is 20. So you will write 20 zero here. And 2 you will carry over here. Then 4 plus 2 is 6 plus 7 plus 1 is 7. 7 plus 6 is 13 and 13 plus 5 is how much? 18. And this you will write 8 here and 1 carry over here. Then you will 2 plus 1 will give you 38. So 38 that is 38 rupees is the Total bill. Okay. Total amount he will have to pay. And how much? He is having 100 rupees with him. Okay. Money he is having is 100. So how much money will he get back? That is what you have to. That is the question. So 100 minus how much? 38. That is 100 minus 38 you have to do. 100 minus 38. What will you get? 100 minus 38. 38. What will you get as answer? Let us see. 10 to 62. So the answer is 62 rupees. So he will get back 62 rupees. So he will pay 100 rupees. The total bill is 38. So he will get back 62 rupees. So in this example you are doing addition of decimals with Two decimal places. So when you are dealing with rupees and paise and when you are dealing with centimeter and meter in all those in both of those cases you will be having two decimal places. But when you are dealing with kilogram gram when you are dealing with kilometer meter and when you are dealing with liter milliliter they will have three decimal places. Okay now let us do an example with Three decimal places. Okay. Now the next example. Here this we are going to deal with kilogram and gram. So what did I tell you? When you are dealing with kilogram and gram. There will be three decimal places. Let us see how it is. Okay. So here <coughs> Reshma bought vegetables. Potato for three quarter. Uh, potato what is the quantity? Three quarter kg. Onion 1 kg, cabbage half kg and tomato quarter kg. Okay. So you know what is the relationship? 1 kg is equal to how much you know? It is 1000 gram. Hmm? And half kg. So how much will be half kg? Half kg will be half of 1000. That is 500 gram. Okay. And you know what is quarter kg? Quarter kg means half of half kg. That is 500, half of 500, that will be how much? 250 gram. Okay. So, this is the 
relationship 1 kg is equal to 100 that means 1000 gram half will be 500 gram and quarter will be 250 gram now here what what are the things bought here potato let us see how much the quantity will be total quantity okay total quantity okay of vegetables okay we will write total quantity how will you do first let us do the calculation in grams as well as in kilograms just to see how it is similar the, uh, when you add in grams it will be addition of integers and you, when you add in kilogram it will be addition of decimals let us see how they are similar we are doing it just to see the similarity okay so first potato how much 3 quarter 3 quarter 1 quarter is 250 so 3 quarter will be 250 plus 250 plus 250 that is 250 into 3 that will give you how much you know it will be 750 so potato is 750 gram okay next plus what is the next one onion onion is 1 kilogram that means 1000 so here you have to add Next next thing is 1000. Thousand. All these are grams, okay? When you first you are adding grams. Next one. So this onion is done. Next, cabbage. Cabbage how much? Half. Half kg. That means 500 gram. Next is tomato. That is quarter, quarter, uh, quarter kilogram. That is 250 gram. Now we will add. What is this? 0, 0, 0. You will add. 5 plus 5 will be... 10, 1 carry, 7 plus 1 will be 8 and 8 plus 7 will be 15, 1 carry you will get 2500 gram. Now this is in gram. Now when you add in kilogram, 5, 750 uh, gram, how will you write it in kilogram? If you want to write 750 in kilogram, what will you do is 750 by 1000. Why? 1 kilogram is 1000 gram. So when you divide this number by 1000, it means you will put decimal. Here there are th uh, 3 zeros, right? So decimal will have 3, three decimal places. That, will, that means it will be 0 0.750. And next one. It is 1000. 1000 by 1000 means it will be 1.000. Okay, 1 kg. Next one, 500. 500 will be, we will do the same way. What is it? 500 by 1000. How much will, it will be? 3 decimal places I told, no? 0 0.500. Next one will be 0 0.250. Now, here you are adding decimals. Here we added integers. Next decimals. Same way 0, 5 plus 5, 10. 1 carry, 8. 8 plus 7, 15. And 1 carry over here. That means 2. That means what will you get? These are in kg, right? So you will get the answer as 2.5 kg is the total weight of the Vegetables Reshma bought from the market. Okay. So here we are doing this gram addition just to show the similarity. But when you are dealing with some other problems, you just have to do this decimal addition. Okay. And here since we are dealing with kilogram and gram, see how much deci three decimal places are here. When you, are, when you were dealing with uh, rupees and paisa, you had two decimal places. Okay. So we have done one example with two decimal places and one with three decimal places. Okay, sit so clear. Okay.